Insulation. Heat loss through the ceiling and walls in a home could be very significant if the insulation levels are less than the recommended minimum. When the house was built, the builder likely installed the amount of insulation recommended at that time. Given today's energy prices and future prices that will probably be higher, the level of insulation might be inadequate, especially if the home is older. If the attic hatch is located above a conditioned space, it should be as heavily insulated as the attic, weather stripped and closed tightly. In the attic, the openings for items such as pipes, ductwork, and chimneys should be sealed. Any gaps should be sealed with an expanding foam caulk or some other permanent sealant. While the homeowner is inspecting the attic, he or she can check to see if there is a vapor barrier under the attic insulation. The vapor barrier might be tar paper, craft paper attached to fiberglass bats, or a plastic sheet. If there does not appear to be a vapor barrier, the homeowner might consider painting the interior ceilings with a vapor barrier type of paint or primer. Glidden and Sherwin-Williams both make one. Using this reduces the amount of water vapor that can pass through the ceiling and cause mold-related issues in the attic. Large amounts of moisture can reduce the effectiveness of insulation and promote structural damage to the wood framing members.